Hi, I'm Lee Kors, and I'm in downtown Phoenix at the Chico Art Gallery with local artist Joe Ray. Hi, Joe. Thank you for coming and talking to me today. This is a beautiful place that you work in, and I absolutely love your work. It's, it's just amazing. Tell me what inspires you. I like to collaborate with others. And by that, I mean a lot of my inspiration comes from interacting with people. It comes from life, what people say, what, what I hear, music, and just asking people, hey, what do you think of this? I'm thinking about doing that, or what their feelings are on things. And I enjoy collaborating on actual work with other artists also, whether it's a painting, whether it's a monoprint, I like to get their input, their ideas. The piece is mine that I'm working on, it's very personal, but a lot of their input, personality, and passion comes through and inspires me. Tell me about the Pet Angel project that you're working on and how it came about. The Pet Angels are focused on your departed pets. People are very close to, to our pets. They're part of our family, right? So when they're gone, the, their spirit will live on in your home. So we did these Pet Angels that are meant to be hung in a window, looking out or outside under the, your pet's favorite tree or on the patio. But it's something that's very dear to my heart. We're, we have a standard poodle. We're focused on poodles, and part of the profits will go to Arizona Poodle Rescue. Wonderful. Historically, we've seen your work be two-dimensional, and now we're seeing these three-dimensional sculptures in the Pet Angels. Do you see that continuing on, um, or was this something that was just intentional and just for this purpose? When you do something that's wall-focused and two-dimensional, it's there. It'll have depth and everything to it, but I saw this as a really good opportunity to have something that was going to be more interactive. The hanging poodles, the hanging angels are outside. You can walk around them. They move in the wind. The garden ones you place there, you can walk around them. So they're more a product of their environment outside, while a painting, a print that's on the wall is an environment of the inside, or it can be outside also, but it's limited a little bit more in its viewability. If someone came to you and said, I want something in my home and I need your help, because I know a lot of people want art in their home, but they're challenged on what to put and where to put it and how big it should be or what colors it should be. Do you have any advice? What does the piece that you are purchasing say about you in that environment? Mm -hmm. First of all, how's it gonna make you feel like you as a homeowner? And also when people come over, what do you want them to feel? It was wonderful meeting you today and seeing all of your beautiful artwork. Where can the folks at home learn more about you? There's more information on my website, which is joeray.com. And that you can see examples of my work on there. You can also reach out and contact me as to where my work is on display. Or for the pet angels, you can see what's going on there at omgpetart.com. Thank you so much for talking to me today and showing me your work.